so much human interaction at a time, to be honest. I don't know. It really depends for me. But usually, if I'm around too many people uh, for too long, I just it just wears me out. Whether he made him aware of my separated gaze or not, she starts to take something out, then quickly shoves it back in. She gives me a smile, implying some secret. too soon for you to see that. Ah, what were you about to pull out? Not tell me. Upon saying that, Kimino quickly closes the bag. The way I see it, it is a wonder she fit all of the supplies she had just She had it out just a moment ago. I wondered where it was all being stored. By the way, no club today? I asked with the underlying
said I wanted to go to the pool. It is all the more important. See, it is completely fair though, because she chooses to exercise. not to think about it. Those are things from long ago. Things from the past. Things that are done. I can do nothing but deal with the pain that feels as if something is pressing against the inside of my skull. Sucks. Migrants and headings suck. Lots of things suck. I finally hear Himino calling me in a loud voice. The elevator's this way! Come on! I push my... I push away my headache and stop step through the automatic door the information of the entrance and the placement of the crane game are exactly the same as that day giving me a slightly bad feeling from the elevator landing we need to head for we're at the top floor of the separate Menton East building. The elevator is the type that has a glass window so you can see out. <coughs> uh, sorry, I think I'm getting sick, guys. This sucks. 
that is the only thing that distracting me from my gloom. Okay, I think I believe that is a typo. A crowd of people get on with us, but almost all of them are gone by the time we reach the floor that contains the aquarium. They probably stopped off at the apparel or sun dries shops. What are sun dries? It isn't that we aren't interested, but Himino recommends that it's. <sighs> but Himino recommends it's crowded now, so let's come back when it's less busy. And that keeps us back, deciding to stick with the plans we made back at the coffee shop.
so you're forgetting to tell me with a lie then, you little... I had intended to protest firmly, but it still ended rather anticlimactically. Ghosts may exist, and they still may be unable to come back, but that doesn't mean I'm interested in visiting places where they are. So, Minton Aquarium is officially haunted. Yay! Something about the aquarium and the missing persons who didn't come home. That was essentially. Okay, that popped up again. Oh, sorry. Uh, are you okay, Mayu? Sorry, I guess I scared you a bit too much. I think this story is pretty exaggerated, so don't worry about it. I heard it was a fun aquarium. I think we should take those stories with a grain of salt. Right? Though her kindness is misdirected, it is kindness just, the s kindness just the same. Having involuntarily sat down, I take the hand Himino extends to me. As I slowly rise to my feet, I respond, Yeah, you're right. To think that I would hear of a connection to my precious memory in a place like this. Precious? Click. Ah, it's strange. After five years, the memory should have faded. I tell myself this. Then I let out a small sigh. Himino is actually showing concern, so I sit down on a bench in the rest area next to the souvenir shop. Himino even brings me a can of cocoa. As I'm drinking it, she buys our tickets. With her doing all of this, I have to go with her. Are you okay, miss? And with that, guys, I'm going to end right here at The Unfamiliar Man. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, be sure to hit the like button, as well as subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Maybe give me a couple theories as to what you think that's going to happen. I have no idea. But I think that's part of the excitement of this game. Or, uh, visual novel game thing. And, with all of that being said, guys... Don't do drugs and don't get arrested. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.